In this video, I'm going to show you how to use FPS Mesh Tool to prepare a standard character mesh for use in a first-person shooter. So here we have our character mesh, single material. Preview. Just thresholds to get a result that looks good. Build the new mesh, and we're done. Here is our new character. As you can see, we have multiple materials. One for the arms, one for the body, one for the head. And we can replace any of these that we want. Give us nothing but arms, for example. Or just remove the head. Our mesh is now ready for use in UFPS or whatever first-person shooter projects we want. Nice and easy. Again, you see we have multiple materials. Uh, these are the three materials for the main body. And then this mesh had a separate material for the head. also work on characters that have more than one mesh renderer. Like this one here. When you have more than one renderer, you can choose which of the mesh renderers to process. So as you can see here, the armor is a separate mesh. Now in this case, uh, the helmet is not a skinned mesh, it's just a standard object, so you would handle transparency for that separately. It works the same. There's our new object. And again, there's the body. The armor.